Zach Selwyn here live. All right, that's a little loud. Zach Selwyn here live in front of the Vista Theater where local residents here at this small Hollywood community are outraged that Ant-Man and Wasp has been the only film in this theater for over a month. As you see behind me, protesters are just lining up, getting ready to make this theater change it over. As these protests grow, you can hear the police coming in. Those sirens are real, folks. There is a definite riot. Where'd it go? The film everybody would like to see here is the new Mission Impossible 7 or 8 or whatever number they're up to on that franchise. As for the reviews of Mission Impossible, this film critic had this to say. It's a bloated, lighthearted romp with Tom Cruise performing his own breakneck crazy stunts. And although it's predictable, Cruise's swagger is impossible to deny. Am I going to recommend it? Yes, I am. <laughs> People are so excited about the film, they're posting photos of Tom Cruise on light posts everywhere here. It's just mayhem. And as you can see, people are setting up tents here, getting ready for the tickets to go on sale. What's that, Marty? Oh, those are... Okay, yeah, we should cut. Once again, Zach Selwyn here in Los Feliz. We are getting to the bottom of this. By the way, is it Los Feliz or Los Feliz? Marty, it's, it's Feliz, right? You don't say Feliz Navidad. Look it up. And if you come with me to this adjacent alley, you see people have begun urinating in cups on the ground. That is definitely a cup full of hot urine. So until this film changes at the Vista, residents of this small town will have to deal with six to eight more weeks of Paul Rudd and Jessica Biel. It's going to be a hell of a... What's that? Oh, that's... Oh, that's Evangeline, the girl from Lost? Damn! There's handprints from the cast of Showgirls here? Where is that? We'll have more for you as the active situation unfolds inside. Come on, come on, let's go, 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 go. 